Hello everyone, I just wanted to go through very quickly on my furnace um, fix. It was a very quick fix, luckily. Um, I have this uh, Nest thermostat which told me that there was no power at all. Uh, I remember it was error 74 or 75. Um, it was missing the pin 24, no power at all. And um, the main problem I was having was uh, the Nest would detect it. It would, you know, my furnace would start warming up and all the gas and stuff like that. It would start. And then uh, at a certain point it would stop and then I would get the error no power detected so this is why I was like okay maybe um, something is wrong with the blower motor and um, I tried to spin it so as it wanted to uh, start and warm up I tried to spin it and it, and, it, and it did spin and then I was like okay so what's wrong with it and I realized that furnaces heat heating furnaces has this thing called the run capacitor this thing Basically, what it does is um, it creates a magnetic field and helps the blower motor to push, give it a nice push, and then blow the the, um, the, the air out. But if this is bad, okay, uh, it would, what wouldn't work. So this was the bad one. It's uh, It says 5 FMD, but it's basically a microfarad, uh, 5 microfarad uh, plus minus 5% error, 370, 4440. So as you can see, there's um it's two sides but uh, there's no polarity on these run caps so you don't don't worry if you're hooking it up and anyways you'll notice that these two cable wires here are uh, the same color so it means the pol polarity does not matter um, I couldn't find the same size as this one right here so I got this one a bit bigger but the specs are the same you see five microfarad and uh, instead of the U on this one this is an M, but you read it as microfarad, but it's weird because M usually, um, like uppercase M means mega. And in this case, they should have put it like a lowercase M and uh, uppercase F and D, but whatever. So I got this for eight bucks at the electronic store and uh, it does run properly right now. It it runs perfectly actually. And then uh, there was, it was actually my bad because if you guys have the symptoms, for example, um, my furnace, you know, you, it would start and then it would, you know, heat up. And after a while, it would just stop. And then it's gonna start back again. And then it will finally blow the um, the hot air for my house. I, I didn't, re I thought that was normal. But after I changed this, I, I realized that, you know, I would it would just warm up and then it would blow right away the heating so this means the run capacitor was was starting to be bad it told me about it and I didn't even do anything about it until it was too late and then I changed this capacitor it was actually like down there it was like hook into like this bracket right here I don't know if you can see it but there was this bracket right here it's really like attached not attached but sticked to the blower motor at the bottom and uh, everything was working fine. I was checking on the wires and everything. And uh, yeah, now it, it works perfectly. Um, the Nest does not detect any more error. And um, so yeah, that's the story about my furnace. And I hope it helped you guys. Um, try to change this $8 run capacitor. 5 microfarad or 10 microfarad should work. And the 10 microfarad, well, it's a bit bigger. So it might, might take more time to charge. So thank you guys for watching and I hope it helped you guys to fix your heating furnace. So once again, it's the run capacitor that was the problem. It was $8 for me. And it wasn't the blower motor.